Well, if you were to ask me who Bob Ensman was, Dr. Robert Duncan Ensman worked with uh, the pioneers of our space industry before NASA. He took Goddard's grand design. Goddard worked with him. He worked with Von Braun. He changed the face of our country um, in terms of the space race and also in terms of military defense. He had a dream and that was to be a space faring human race. We started FRIA uh, in uh, 2018 for the purpose of publishing the material that he had accumulated throughout his entire life and he lived to be nearly 100 years old and publishing this information that has never seen the light of day has been a challenge because the way Bob worked uh, all areas of science were interconnected therefore information that we're looking for on propulsion systems or garden decks for a starship or geology on earth versus geology on the moon, those topics are all included and sometimes on the same piece of paper. To cover the subject matters of the archive, think of it this way. The man had three doctorates and four master's degrees. That says a lot right there. But if you're going to design a starship, if you're going to put together a biosphere that is going to support life and not just human life, but all the life that you need to be humans and live, in an enclosed uh, capsule in space, you have to know everything. You have to know ecology, you have to know biology, you have to know medicine, you have to know how things work, you have to know your geology, you have to know how things are produced, you have to know how to produce clothing and materials and everything it takes to be human on a smaller scale needs to be learned and that's his research into all of those things are what we have in the archive. He just had so many different facets. You could really not pin him down to any one thing. He was a writer, he was a painter, and an explorer. And somehow his brain just never stopped working. He had a vision to expand our lifestyle onto other planets, so he had to understand every aspect of a human's lifestyle. Everything they spoke, everything they ate, everything they did, their bodies. He was a medical doctor. He just, he needed to know everything. We have a, a great vision for Freya. Um, we've got a five to 10 year plan and beyond. We also know what we have to accomplish tomorrow and the next day. Um, there's a lot of levels of activity here. We have to uh, pull out work from the archive, look through it, create a manuscript. We have to publish his science fiction stories that there are hundreds of that he wrote. I hope that Freya reaches out to as many people as possible, and I hope it, it encourages people to look beyond our literal horizon. Freya has been entrusted with a national treasure. Uh, it is our responsibility to preserve the work of Dr. Ensman and to find out what is in here, get it organized, and publish it and make it accessible.